Good morning, good morning, good morning, family. This is your girl, Tiffany, owner and operator of All Things Jerling's Kitchen. Jerling's Kitchen Cuisine and Things on YouTube, TikTok, and Twitter. And Jerling's Kitchen on Facebook and Instagram. Please like follow and share all of our social media platforms and if you're watching this on youtube please 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 subscribe or don't forget to subscribe um and also engage engage in the comments and let me let me know your your thoughts on anything or any of the content that i post i know it's been a long it's been a long time it's been a while but this is your morning affirmation. Um, I had a dentist appointment this morning. And as I mentioned, which I have not done, um, I've also incorporated a workout routine somewhat um, every morning, which is new to me. Working out isn't new, but being consistent, you know, is. We all can relate to you know saying that okay i'm gonna um i'm gonna exercise or walk or do this um, this amount this day and starting out you know you have all great intentions i believe most people do i know i do and you start out strong in the beginning and then it starts to fizzle out so i've been incorporating some exercise um, trying to create a routine for myself um, but I hadn't been able to record it why because by the time I remember to record it I'm halfway through my routine so listen I told you it's, al it's already been a struggle to be able to do it and then to stop it and set up a camera to record it I was like nah let me keep going so <laughs> that yeah that content will be coming soon but just to be able to share with y'all because again if you read the description of my channel um I'm on I'm it's part of my journey it's part of my journey to being a better me and fulfilling the purpose that God has created me for so and part of that is to be able to share my journey with you guys as encouragement, motivation, to inspire you, maybe entertain you, whatever it is that you need. Um, that's part of my um, my my purpose that God has created me for. But enough of that. So I went to the dentist as I started saying and. I like my dentist's office because part of their decor on the wall, they have this cute art, nice art, but the art has very um, inspirational uh, sayings or, or quotes or something like that, right? And you know how you can see the same thing a couple times, but never take note to it, never take notice to it. But one particular day, one particular moment, you see it as if it was the first time you saw it. So that's what happened today, right? So I'm, you know, I got up, you know, did my um, my morning devotions as I normally do. And I've al I had already planned on creating a video to upload my um, affirmation, um, but got a kind of got a late start because again I was doing my exercise routine or whatever and then I had to go straight to the dentist and then I saw this note in the um in the room that I was in that said not all storms disrupt your journey some come to clear the path let me repeat that not all storms disrupt your journey some come to clear the path. And when I tell you, I know, I know I've seen this. I've seen um, that message in that room a few times. But today was the day that it really stood out. It really stood out. And so 
I think because for I'm, I, I, I want to say the last month, but really, no, it's been like a year, if not a little bit longer that I had noticed I had been um, like my life kept being disrupted. It kept being disrupted. My mood kept being disrupted. My attitude kept being disrupted. You know, just a lot of different uh, things that I had been um, dealing with. Um, and I know a lot of it was, was spiritual. Going through it at the time, I did not, um, you know, that it wasn't revealed to me at that time. But I know that it, it, it had a lot to do with the spirit. But seeing that message today, you know, made a lot of things clear. So... I say to you that embrace your storm. You don't know what it is that um, God is trying to, you know, remove out of your way or out of your life for you to reach, you know, a better, a better position, a higher position. Storms are necessary. We don't like to think that they are because when we're going through the storm, it don't feel good. When, when you're going through the storm, sometimes it comes with some losses that you weren't ready to let go of or ready to lose. And that is the hardest part of going through, you know, a storm. And so but once you get, you know, on the other side, you know, of the storm and you see that whatever it was that you lost or that was removed or that God had clear for you, all you can do is just is just rejoice, right? Because you're like, I, I, I know if I had relied on my own strength, my own understanding, that, yeah, this would not have happened, and this was so necessary. You get to a point like that, it, it brings so much peace. So I'm so thankful um, for the storms like like i said this last year or so i have been going through a lot of different challenging times not really understanding why at the time um but now i know that they you know were necessary so my attitude towards certain things have changed my attitudes towards certain people have changed i've um created some boundaries i've become silent I become distant, you know, with people, with certain people, and it's been necessary. It's been it's been necessary, um, not not so much for them. Well, I guess so for them, but more so for me to have the peace that I that I have, and where I'm able to focus on the things that matter instead of those things that um, don't necessarily matter as much, or I was putting so much um, so much focus on. But I thank you guys for continuing to reach out to me. As you can see, I'm outside. I literally just got back, you know, from um, the dentist's office. And I wanted to make sure I did this video. And I said, while, while it was on my mind, I'm going to just take out my phone and just record so I can share, share it with you guys. But again... Thank you for reaching out to me. Thank you for your support. Um, as it relates to Jerlene's Kitchen, there's a lot of things that I am doing that you guys don't get to see. And it's a reason um, for that. And so I'm, I thank God for the way he's moving my business and the way that he's leveling it up. So... Yeah, just don't get so caught up. I do want to say this, and I'm a, I'm I'm gonna end it because it's becoming longer than I had expected. But don't get caught up on seeing what you see on social media and making a determining um, decision or a determination that what you see is what's real. So just because you know. A person or a company or whatever don't post certain things um, doesn't mean those things aren't happening like 
I had someone inbox me. Not even inbox me. I had a couple people inbox me, but I've had a couple people that I ran past or came in contact with and was like, hey, are you still in business? And I was like, yeah, why, why wouldn't I be? Well, I don't see you post anything. Well, but that's because I'm busy. <laughs> so if I'm busy, you know, it's, it's really hard to post, you know. So I don't have, I don't, I don't want to say I'm a one-woman machine, but pretty much I am. I run the day in and day out of my business. And when I need um, help or a staff per se, and that's usually when I am servicing an event, then that's when I have it. Outside of that, it's really me doing the day in and day out of my business. So being able to post, which I will eventually, because that's part of the growth of my business, but I'll have someone or some ones that are going to manage that part of my business. <clears throat> and that's where God is moving me, moving me to and moving the business um, to. So... Hey, I mean, social media has its pros, its cons, but you just got to be careful with how you allow it to influence you. So, but I don't want to sound like I'm rambling. So I'm going to let this be the end of it. Again, I thank you guys for your support. Continue to like, follow, share and engage engage that helps with the algorithms that helps me also know the impact that i'm having in your life i thank you for all the positive um the positive comments i appreciate that um so y'all enjoy y'all day make it a great one be blessed